everyone, welcome back to my channel, The Mom Life 7. Today, as you can see from the title, I have a 99 cent store haul for you guys. And I have a, like a very small Dollar Tree haul as well. I thought I might as well get it out the way because this the, um, 99 cent store haul is not as big as my usual ones. And yeah, I'm out here barefaced today. Uh, it was the kids' first day at school. And so I'm, I'm in full-blown mommy mode. And I don't have time to be glad. This is me every day. You know what I'm saying? So I hope you guys like it. I mean, or you should, don't have any offense to it. I'm on the Alicia Keys movement. No, I'm just kidding. No makeup. So anyway, um, you know, I know I get a lot of compliments. And people are like, oh, you. So I just want to know what you guys going to say when you guys see me. Just like on my everyday self, you know. So sometimes I may, you know, have time to you know put on a face or whatever have my daughter to put it on for me and some days I'm just gonna be in mom mode because I want to get this haul out to you guys you know I feel like that was important that I get this haul out because now we got the kids to bed they're asleep their dad is on his way home from work to help me right after this I'm, I'm cooking some pasta today and I have a, um, a cooking video that's gonna become I'm gonna be filming right after this I'm gonna bring you guys in the kitchen with me so anyway um, I want to show you guys what I got I want to um, Thank everyone for tuning in, and if you're a returning subscriber, well, you know, um, thank you for coming back. And if you're new, you know, welcome. I see I have some new people. Welcome, 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 welcome. Everyone's welcome, new and old. You all are welcome. You know, I love everybody. I like to share what I find. I love to share these finds and share them with you guys. Like I said, to me, in my opinion, this is not a big haul compared to what I normally do. You know, y'all know I do everything big. I, I don't. It's not on purpose, that's just me, you know. I do everything big, and like the song says, Big Bank, Take Little Bank, you feel me? So, Big Bank, Take Little Bank, YG, 2 Chains, Big Shine, Nicki Minaj, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm on my Big Bank, Take Little Bank, and you know, the Big Bank takes the Little Bank. So, right, today I have a small bank as far as I'm concerned. So, because of that, I'm going to throw in that Dollar Tree haul again uh, at the end. So, let me show you guys what I got. I did get some pretty neat stuff. I'm trying to, you know, cut back and comp, you know, on hauling so much because I pretty much have everything I need. I have a few wish list items that I'm looking for, but nothing too major, you know, that I can't do without. But, you know, if I see it, I may grab it or whatever. But I want to keep, I hope you guys like that. I've been, you know, a little more consistent getting videos out to you guys. I have some more videos coming, so look out for those. Be on the lookout for those coming really, really soon. I'm going to try to get two videos out because it won't get out tonight, so it'll probably be tomorrow. Hopefully I can pump two out tomorrow and then come through with another one after that. So I got a lot of exciting things uh, coming for you guys really soon. So I don't want to waste too much time. Let me get into this haul. If you haven't already, please um, uh, give my video a thumbs up. A big thumbs up. Please, please, please. It would help me out so much. And if you haven't already, I would love to have you. Just come on and subscribe. I'll wait. Just come on. Well, go ahead. Subscribe. Subscribe. It's free. It's free. Just come on and subscribe. So anyway. Um and share the video leave me a comment you know you guys leave me some wonderful comments and I love it you know what I'm saying so it's all good let me show you guys what I got again this is a small but it's still a, a nice haul I, I'm, I really like the stuff that I got um right here let me get the excuse me perishable so I'm sorry about getting away y'all represent for my Raiders you know y'all already know I'm from the Bay Area the Yay area represent I did I say Raiders I meant Warriors well Raiders too that's my other team you feel me all that. Everything Bay Area for me. You feel me? Anyway, these are some grapes. I believe these were 99 cents a pound. Um, actually, this is our second bag. I bought a bag, and before I can haul it, the kids ate it up, so I picked up another bag. But I said this bag wasn't as good as the first one. Like, I didn't get a chance to get any. They ate them up for me. For me, and um, I got more strawberries. I meant to pick up more, so. For 99 cents for a pint of strawberries is really good and I can never have too many of them. Okay, I also picked this up. I thought this was pretty interesting. It's a um, Vega, plant-based Vega protein. This is a vanilla flavor. It says it's new. It's a um, cashew milk yogurt alternative. 13 grams of protein, 7 grams of sugar. It's a prebiotic and probiotic. Cashew and plant protein. Good source of four minerals. Rich in fiber. It's gluten-free. It's dairy free, it's vegan, uh, certified non-GMO, and all that kind of good stuff. And the reason I was really interested in one thing was because I think at Target I've seen like a Vega protein like powder that you can make like a protein shake or something with. So I'm thinking it could be by that same brand because it looks familiar. So I'm thinking so and I really wanted to try it and it has a cashew uh, milk or turn, you know, in here. 
So I thought this would taste pretty good. And I really want to try to, I believe it was 99 cent. I think so. Either they were 99 cent or two, but I believe they were 99 cent, but it could have been two for 99. Don't quote me. And then I also got the strawberry flavor one. So I'm really looking forward to trying this one as well because I think this is really interesting to me. I just hope it tastes as good as, as I'm hoping, <laughs> you know. <laughs> okay, another um, cool find was this uh, uh, Polio, um, it's a part skim ricotta cheese. So it's part skim milk, um, Italian, premium Italian. So, okay, now it was 99 cents and this is 32 ounces. Now, I know a ricotta cheese is not cheap. And I know this is a good deal for 99 cent. Now, my only thing is that, honestly, I don't care for ricotta cheese. I actually tried to make some lasagna at one time. And I was trying to be all fancy like the chefs and stuff. And I said, oh, you know what? I, I'm going to buy some ricotta cheese and try that instead of normally I use cottage cheese. And I tried it with the cottage cheese and it was like, eh, I didn't like it. I didn't like the taste. So maybe my taste buds and change i'm going to try it one more time or maybe i'll do two pans or half and half you know a pan with um ricotta and a pan with the cottage cheese because i like it the way i normally make it so we'll see how this turns out this is expiring so i'm probably going to do it this weekend so i'm gonna see how this turns out because it's a pretty big thing ricotta cheese but i'll be seeing people hyping i'm like i don't like ricotta cheese it was not good to me you know i don't know what is going on with my taste buds but i wasn't feeling it Okay, another cool find, uh, this is the Treetop Organic Applesauce, no sugar added, and um, you get how many in here? Six, you get six of them. My daughter, she, my seven-year-old, she really likes um, applesauce, and so I think they had uh, other flavors too, and then, you know, I think they had a cinnamon, I seen somebody else have strawberry. So, um, this is good for her to take to school, you know, for snacking and stuff like that in her snack bag since they just started back to school today. And then we also got these, these are Oreo Thin Bites Fudge Dip Coconut Cream. I apologize if this is a repeat, but it's by Nabisco. It's a name brand. It was 99 cents. Good deal. Uh, somebody picked this up. It wasn't me. I'll just say that. This is a Monster Rehab Tea plus Pink Lemonade plus Energy. 10 calories, Energy Iced Tea. You know, people always grab and stuff, putting it in the cart. <laughs> And then my daughter is really loving these lately, so I grabbed another one of these Hello Panda, the chocolate filled, um, chocolate cream filled cookies. She really likes these, the bite sized ones. And then um, I, we used up the family pack of the premium crackers. Like I said, my kids really love those. And they're gone, and I need to get them some more. And this is all they have. Two, it came with two packs, and my son had already went through one, so there's one more pack left in here. I don't know how good of a deal this is. I guess it's okay. I'd rather have the regular normal size of pack where you get four of them in there all that big family size with six was really an excellent deal but for 99 cents it was just something to try to hold the kids over until I get you know hopefully locate a bigger pack okay I got this right here I never tried this before never even heard of it before it's called it's chata I guess the brand is chata it's a refried pinto beans um, no preservatives let me see Mexican product it says Mexican product here, yeah, product of Mexico. It's a 15.2 ounces, so I thought it was cool, you know. Uh, refried beans, you know, I might be making some enchiladas or something. Who knows, you know, I might need some refried beans or something. So I thought we'd give those a try. Um, I picked up another one of these Jack Daniels barbecues that I thought I thought about it. You know, like I said, this is one of my go-to brands, Jack Daniels or KC Masterpiece or Sweet Baby Ray's and stuff like that. So this is the sweet and spicy, and I really liked it, um, the package. I, I guess it's one of my go-to brands, so... I thought for 99 cents it was a good deal. Why not grab another one? You know, summer hasn't ended quite yet. Somebody with me picked this up. I don't know why. I'm just going to pass this over because that's super boring and angel hair. I, don't even buy, I haven't bought pasta roni in years. That's like for amateurs. I used to buy that back in the day, but now I make my stuff from scratch. Not the pasta. I can with my KitchenAid mixer. I can make my own pasta. I haven't tried that, but... You know, I make my own Alfredo sauce and stuff, which you're going to see in my recipe. So you guys make sure y'all tune in for that if you guys like cooking videos. I got a nice uh, recipe coming up for you guys, so and show y'all how I do it. All right, I also picked this up for my kids. Now, normally, to be honest with you, my kids don't really eat this anymore. After we start buying this, another brand, I'll show you guys in another video. So, um, are they still cut? It's like a still cut oat milk kind of. It's kind, they come in packages kind of like instant, but my kids have... After we start serving that to my kids, oh my daughter grabbed it for me. This right here, we give them this, this Better Oats Steel Cut 
instant oatmeal with flax seeds. It's a made from brown sugar, if you can see that, ready in the two and nine. So after I start getting, you get 10 pouches in here. It'll be like, what, two something at Winco? Maybe 248, two something, don't quote me, it's two something, I believe. I like Winco's prices, that's why I get it there. So after we start buying this, my kids don't normally go for the regular Quaker instant oatmeal, but I don't know, I thought maybe, you know, that this would be interesting. They might want to try this because it, it's a strawberry, oh, I broke a nail, Lord have mercy. Strawberry instant oatmeal, and it has like these little things inside there, so I thought, um, you know, they might be interested in that, we'll find out in a minute. <laughs> And let me see. Okay, and then we also needed some vinegar for something we're doing around the house. So I grabbed two more bottles of vinegar and they were 99 cent. And then I was really excited about this. I actually grabbed two, but we used one already because we um, bought a whole chicken and cut it up and fried it the other night. And this is $1.99. I don't know about this brand, 100% pure vegetable oil. And it's a 48 ounce bottle, cholesterol free. So I don't know what brand this is, but I thought for $1.99 is really good, especially for 48 ounces of vegetable. And I grabbed two. I probably really should have grabbed more. You know, I'm trying to cut back on fire, fried food so much, but you know, I did grab it. And let me see what else I got. Oh, okay. Let me see. Oh, this right here. Pretty excited. I uh, kept seeing people post these and I kept missing them. I guess I was going too late. And then I went in one day and we hit the jackpot at one store and got one and went to another store and got two other flavors. So this is the, uh, normally we get the coffee mate, but I know this is another good brand. This is a really good brand. And this is the Bailey's um, non-alcoholic coffee cream. And this is toffee almond cream. And it was $1.99. And like I said, it's a toffee almond cream flavor. It's 32 full ounces, but I got a good story to tell you guys about this. So I did pay $1.99 for this, as you can see from the tag. And I know that's good for, you know, that particular product. And then, um, this is another flavor I got. Because at the first store, I got one, which is coming up. And then at the second store, I got these two. This is the same thing, but the Irish cream flavor. My daughter just dropped it when we were pulling out the refrigerator. That's why some from the other one waste on here. You guys going to see that in a minute. Anyway, it's basically the same thing, just a different flavor. This is the Irish cream. And then, um, the first store I actually walked in... It didn't have, it wouldn't ring up. My daughter just dropped this tonight, we're <laughs> pulling it out. It would not ring up. So the guy actually gave it to us for, um, well maybe it was the other one. Yeah, cause it didn't, it, it, even though it says $1.99, it would not ring up, so he gave it to us for uh, 99 cents. He took two 50 cent items, rung it up twice, and we only paid 99 cents for one of these. And like I said, my daughter just was. And this is the vanilla, what was here? Vanilla brown sugar uh, flavor, so yeah. We got coffee creamer for days. That's really a really good deal. And then another good deal. And I haven't really seen anybody else with it yet. But you know, I, I can't say I'm the only one of the first. I don't know. Because there's a lot of people out there probably have stuff that they're not sharing and got it before me. But we walked in and they had this California uh, pizza um, kitchen chicken fajita. It's a fajita, uh, chicken fajita style. Uh, crispy thin crust pizza. This is a 14.8 ounce package. I hope you guys can see this. It's California Pizza Kitchen and um, I'm sure everybody's familiar with that non-GMO made with organic chicken and tomatoes. It's new they said and um, we tried it. Well actually we bought four of them. I had my daughter try it. She didn't care for it. I tried it. Um, we weren't crazy about the crust. We may have left it out too long because we actually had picked it up at the first store so the crust this wasn't crispy enough for us but we got two more left and then we also picked this up um these spicy zawain noodles noodles um it's a noodle dish with roasted black bean sauce and it was $1.99 i think you get like what four packs in here or it says calling it a family pack you get four of them in here so it was $1.99 so we thought we'd give that a try my daughter tried it already and then um we also picked up more of the um Two times spicy noodles. We picked up three more of those. I thought this was a cool find. I kept I've seen a few people post this. This is the barefoot. Um, it's a spritzer. It's like a wine spritzer. Um, summer red spritzer. So it's a red wine spritz, spritzer, basically. I never tried this before, and um, I thought it was pretty interesting. It seemed like it might taste really good. So. You know, if we have us a little backyard boogie oogie, you know, backyard boogie oogie, <laughs> or a little shindig or something like that, you know, like put these in the cooler, chill them, have that grown and sexy, uh, you know, cool, refreshing drink. So I actually went in one day and I stumbled across these. Um, 
I hadn't seen anybody post them yet, but you know, I got these right here. It's by Basic Beauty Simple, Simple Elegance. It's a makeup remover cleansing towel edge. Removes 99.3% of your most stubborn makeup and even waterproof mascara. You get 40 pre moistened towelettes, and they feel pretty moist. Gentle, ultra soft gloss offer you superior cleansing and makeup removal at your fingerprints and it's alcohol free so 40 of these for 99 cents i picked up two i probably should have picked up more but i'm trying to be on the budget y'all so I, you know i did grab two and then really really super exciting i happened to see i don't know who i saw post some makeup brushes i think it was these i believe so they're calling these the, uh, these are my basic beauty as well I got seven different ones let me see I got the powder brush the contour brush blush brush foundation brush let me see another contour brush it's two different sizes of contour brushes I got the eyeshadow brush and a lip brush I got all that and they were 99 cent each they're calling these the um, van the vanilla makeup brushes is what they're calling them, I guess because it has this white pretty white um, handle and then look at these beautiful colors in it oh my god they're beautiful these brushes are gorgeous I don't know if the camera is doing them justice but they're they're absolutely gorgeous you guys absolutely gorgeous and I actually saw I think today 99 fanatics on Instagram had posted um, that um, it's actually a set of 12 so I only have seven so now that I saw that I'm if I run into any other ones uh, I'm gonna be sure to hopefully you know if I'm lucky enough to grab them so I think these I mean they're super beautiful you guys I can't even begin to tell you how happy I am that I got these and then I also stumbled across these now how cute are these this is the um they're, they're called these are unicorn brushes and it's like the beautiful gold handle and it got this pretty like peach colored uh, um, the, uh, what's this part called the brush part I guess or whatever you call it and actually this is the powder brush I think I got seven of these so I got powder brush I got the contour brush I got the blush brush I got the eyeshadow brush okay another kind so both of them for some reason they have two sizes and the contour brushes I don't know you know much about makeup but one of them is smaller than the other one both of these are being called the contour brushes I don't know if you guys can see that or not I also got the lip brush and I got the foundation brush so I pretty much got a lot like they say they got these two contour brushes. I don't know the difference but they're different sizes so you know I guess people that know about makeup know why it's different size contour brushes I don't know but I got a set of I don't know, let me see one two three four five I got seven of those as well so I thought they're beautiful I mean I don't know if the camera but these are the some beautiful brushes they are really beautiful I mean I got some other beautiful ones in the past too and I just like <laughs> they're so beautiful here you don't even want to use them you know and so I also got this by Sally Hansen this is a velvet texture polish a uh, velvet texture nail polish amazing um, I got this black one and then when I went back they had a blue a green and a purple but I didn't grab those colors yet I'm gonna try this one and see how this one works for me and it was 99 cents and like I said those makeup brushes were 99 cents each and then I also got these right here these are disposable plastic gloves one size fits all you get a hundred gloves in here for 99 cents so I thought that was an excellent deal uh, I had mentioned in like one of my last previous hauls maybe the last one or the one before I was looking for my oxy stuff is it oxy here yeah. and it, this was 199 you get two of them and I couldn't find it but I did locate it someone in the household misplaced it so I found it and these um, you get the super oxygen bathroom cleanser look like and then a super both of them are foaming foaming super oxygen toilet bowl cleaners with and they're both look like 14.5 fluid ounces so uh, got that went in one day hadn't seen anybody with these either at the moment but who knows and I stumbled across this um, by Contemple it's a two piece well uh, it's by so to Contemple uh, circle wear I guess circle wear is probably the brand Contemple uh, so oil and vinegar jars um, they're 13.6 ounces and like I said it says oil and vinegar like a copper kind of they're super cute and my Instagram just started blowing up people went bananas over this so after that I started seeing people haul them and uh, yeah this was I thought they were $3.99 by the way I actually I had passed on them I said you know what those are super cute but I don't really need them right now and I love them that people just kept going crazy on them. I said well dang maybe I should have got them 
And it was like, yeah, girl, you're going to regret it. So I went back <laughs> and got it. And then I went back again another day. And I ran into, like, the matching salt and pepper shaker. How cute is that? And these are smaller. These are 4.42 uh, ounces. Same brand. These are $2.99. And they're super cute little salt and pepper shakers. So I have the oil and vinegar and the salt and pepper. How cool is that, you guys? But I was also super excited about this. Um... I thought it was super cute. It's a uh, letter board with photo frame. And it, this is the blue one. And it has the frame in the middle. And it also has the letters. It comes with letters that you can make your own. Personalize what you wanted to say. And I got this because I was thinking about putting it in my bedroom. And putting my baby boy's, maybe his newborn picture. Or a picture of him in here. And then, ooh, I'm about to drop one, huh? And then I also got the um, pink one for my baby girl. And they were $3.99 and I was thinking about, you know, right, putting some kind of letter, using the letters on here and uh, putting her picture or her newborn picture in there and putting these in my bedroom. So that's what I'm thinking so far what I might do with them. And then I got these because I had got some letter boards recently. Well, you know, previously. And um, I got this one. I thought it was really cute because it's a blue one. So I was going to put this on my son's side of the room and, you know, personalize it for him. And it lights up. It was $4.99. And then I got the pink one, too. And I was going to put this on my daughter's side of the room to say, you know, her side, Layla's side of the room, BJ's side of the room. Something. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do or put their name on it or something. So I got a pink and a blue for my baby boy and my baby girl. And then for me, I got this. I couldn't resist this. This was so gorgeous, you guys. They had another one with the lady like running across the street and you can see a big picture of the Eiffel Tower in the background. I mean, who doesn't want to go to Paris, friend? I mean, I want to go to Paris one day. I would love to go to Paris. And it was $4.99. I wasn't happy with the price, but I couldn't pass it up. It has like the little, let's say, um, uh, something creep, creep, creep air. And it's a hotel. You can see the Eiffel Tower in the background. It's like holographic. It's really cute, you guys. I could I just saw this and I said, uh, -uh I gotta have this. I'm gonna put it in my bedroom somewhere. I'm gonna figure it out how it's gonna go in there. But I really love this piece right here, you guys. And I couldn't pass it up. I had to get it. Also, since the kids just started back to school, they needed socks. I got these uh, Joe Boxer socks. It's a seven pack for my son. They were one ninety nine. And I got this um, this other pack, of, a seven pack of socks for my daughter. And these are one on as well. Really pretty colors in there. Really cute socks. And then we went back and we got my daughter another pair. We got to find my son another pair. She she wore one this morning. Really cute. It was like pink and yellow or something. I forgot. She wore one out of here this morning because today was the first day of school. And then we got her these underwear. These are cheaper than the ones I got at Macy's for them. Because you guys will see that in my back to school uh, haul coming that's coming up. Should drop tomorrow. Um... It's a three pair pack, um, $1.99, cotton panties for girls, it says Wonder Girl, and you, like I said, you get three pair in here, and I thought they were really cute fashion girl, oh, that's so cute, so I got those way cheaper than the ones I paid for at Macy's, <laughs> and then, um, then I bought at Macy's, and these right here for my son, these are some, what, boxers, yeah, boys boxers, how many you get in here? Three? You get three in here, boys plaid woven boxers. Um, these were $3.99. So yeah. Way cheaper than his Calvin Klein ones that came from Macy's, y'all. I'll tell you that much. So yeah. I, I knew I could find them something cheaper at the 99. And I'm still not done shopping. Still got more to do for them. And then my daughter has saw me post this on Instagram. And this is from their uh I think like their spring leftover spring items and they were 25 cents each. And she said, Mom, get that. That'll be good for when we're washing the kids' hair. You know, to, you know, to pour the water, you know, rinse their hair with. So I said, okay, it's only $0.25. Cent. I'll grab one. So I did put me and my broken nail down. Look at that. Yeah, so I'll grab one for $0.25. Cent. And then I saw this bag for my daughter. I couldn't pass it up. Because she loves JoJo Siwa. <laughs> and she's like a big JoJo Siwa fan. And it says, bowls make everything better. And so I thought that was really cute for her. And then I had ran into these and I hadn't seen anybody post these yet either. And I was like, these are hecka cute. And they had this one with the furry pink handle. I think one with a furry blue and a furry purple. And they all had a different journal in here. It was $2.99. And 
and it's a BFF journal set. So it's one for you and it's one for your BFF. And it comes with a pen. It's super cute. So she's thinking about sharing this with her BFF. She picked out which one. She saw my Instagram and she decided on which one she wanted. So I went back and grabbed it for her. And like again, like I can't, it, you know, um, stress it enough. If you guys aren't following me on Instagram, please do. Now you may not have Instagram, and I understand it, and that's fine. But if you do, a lot of the people see this stuff way before I even make it to my haul, you know. So it'll be beneficial to you if you do follow me. If you really want to find out what's out there, okay. I got this for me. Um, this is Smart Gear Outdoor Multi Tool. It was three ninety nine. It got ten functions in one. A uh, knife, bottle opener, saw blade, and more in one too. Versatile. And you had 10 functions in one, perfect for the campsite. So they had a red one and they had a, what was it, blue? A blue one. I decided to get the red one. So yeah, I thought this was really neat. Never know, you gotta open a bottle of wine somewhere, you know what I'm saying? Never know. Anything might come in handy for a lot of things. And then I also got this. <laughs> you guys probably saw my last side, I had the kitchen rules, plaques wall art and then I found this new one I like it too it says kitchen rules if you open it close it if you empty it fill it if you spill it wipe it up if you dirty it clean it up if you cook it share it I thought that was so cute and this is so true this is the rules for my kitchen show how I feel about it <laughs> all right also went in one day and I stumbled across this and I posted on my Instagram, people was going bananas, and I was like, dang, should I get it or not? And I think I went back and got it. It's like a little gold, like, um, Eiffel Tower. It was 99 cents. Yep, it was 99 cents. And I thought it was so cute, so I was thinking about how I'm about to redo my room, and I might put this one on my nightstand. And then, uh, my kid's father, I was asking him, what did he think about this one? Should I get it or not? And he... He was like, eh, I said, you should, what do you think? I said, I think I really like it. And it was 99 cents as well. And so I'm thinking about putting this on his side of the bed or his nightstand. It's like a little anchor. And I don't know if it's like a, I can't explain this color, but it's, it's cute as well. So one may go on one side, a nightstand, and the other one may go on the other. That's what I'm thinking so far, guys. That's what the interior decorator in me is thinking. <laughs> and then, y'all already know my last all the two I had a bunch of platters and serving serving wear and y'all know I don't need no more but the spoiled little bread in me no, the spoiled girl in me it can't say no I had to get this it was so beautiful I like the detail around it and like I said I have I have some platters like long platters like this um, you know like you can put some hors d'oeuvres or something on there and I thought it was super cute and it was $2.99 as you guys can see it was $2.99 and I thought it was just super cute and I like the detail of it so I'm sorry again I couldn't pass it up that's me I gotta learn how to say no y'all it's so hard to say no to myself but yeah I, I couldn't pass it up I really didn't need that serving platter you guys but uh, you know you guys are welcome anytime to come through and we we can hook some food up and stuff like that okay so I think that's it for my 99 sister haul let me show you my few little Dollar Tree items I have maybe I can sit down for that part because Whew. Your girl is out of breath now. Excuse me, guys. I had to drink some of my water, my smart water. Oh, I was out of breath. Doing that. Oh, and this is small, huh? Okay. So let me share what I got from Dollar Tree. Okay. Now, in my last video, I had, um, excuse me, uh, a pack of these. Um, let me don't show this hand because I just broke a nail on the end. I had these smart grow nails. And I wasn't crazy about the pattern. But I got this one. I ran into this one too. And this is like a some kind of animal print. Is this like leopard? Is this, is this what they call that leopard print? Of course, you like the animal print stuff. So I'm not really a big animal print person. But I thought, you know, I'd give it a try. But I was just watching a video earlier and they were saying they weren't, I don't know, somebody was, wasn't happy with the glue or the nails or something. I'm not sure. But anyway, I just grabbed another. I was looking for some other patterns and colors, but I haven't located any other ones yet. So. These were 99 cents at Dalton. These were one dollar at Dollar Tree. This is late, and I haven't ate yet. I gotta cook. I'm about to go in the kitchen and cook. All right, now for the well, for the Dollar Tree find of the day, I saw who did I see do this? I don't even remember the lady name. 
but um, she has showed she has found these air fresheners. And I keep telling y'all I'm a 70s child. I'm still 25, but I don't know what happened how I was born in the 70s, but I'm still, you know, I'm still only 25. And it's like a vinyl record. And it said it's ocean scented. And I saw, even though I already picked these up, I saw some other people get their video up before me and get these out before me. But it's fine, it's all good because that's what we're here for is to share, right? And I thought these were super cool. I just like, I, I was just, I just couldn't resist it. I was like, I went to two different stores. I think it was the second store I found these. Yeah, I was like, I gotta find them. I think I, I looked yesterday. I looked yesterday too, didn't find any. And then went today and I happened to find them. Thank you, Jesus. And this is a vinyl record. So I got two of these because I want to keep one as a souvenir. I don't know why. I'm a little collector. Hoarder slash collector. <laughs> collector slash hoarder. No, it's good. Anyway, so this is a vinyl record and it says seven. I thought, how cute is this? Y'all y'all know this is like super cute, you guys. You can't, man. Come on now. And I couldn't, you know, I wasn't going to I wasn't gonna come on here and play myself unless I had the full set, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm already on here with no makeup on. You know what I'm saying? So it's scaring y'all and stuff. So, hey. I gotta at least have my haul together, if, even if I'm not together, you feel me? I'm just being a mom. That's my excuse. I'm a mom. <laughs> Alright, and so, uh, and then I found this one. This is for the 80s. So I was born in the 70s. My first set, the first two kids were born in the 80s, late 80s. <laughs> and so, yeah. Anyway, this is a 80s. This is for the 80s. This one is a cassette player. And it's strawberry scented. This this is so cute. So cute. I feel important or something, you guys. I feel like, hey, I got a nice, wonderful haul that's going to make an impact. No, I'm scared. <laughs> and then, um, of course, let me see. So we got the man covered the 70s. We covered the 80s. Now, where are we going to next? We're going to cover the 90s. I got some 90s babies, too. I got 90, one more 90, 91, and 94. Yeah. The one that uh, helps me anyway so this is a, a cd this is the 90s and this is uh cherry scented oh my how cute these are super cool if y'all don't get these y'all not cool y'all want to be cool get these these are how if you don't like these something's wrong anyway yeah but this is like a little cd how cute are these i ain't never seen them like this before as soon as i saw i just fell immediately in love with it when i saw that video and i was like i have to get it and then last but not least we got to cover the 2000s and as y'all know I started all over again. Would have been done. Had two more babies and they're born in 2000. 2010 and 2013. So I got some 2000 babies too. And uh, this is like the headphones. Headphones, yeah. Cute. And this is a lemon mint. So yeah, uh, they got the ocean for the 70s, strawberry for the 80s, cherry for the 90s, and this is the lemon mint. And the headphones. Yeah, how could, I mean, come on now. These are, I don't know how these work or whatever. Uh, how you do them? What do you do them? But, I mean, I'm a, I don't know if I'm going to put something in a giveaway or whatever. I guess, oh yeah, this one has a string to it. They have like a little string to them. And this has a little hook or something. I don't know. I guess you hang them up or something. I don't know if these for your, maybe they for your car or something. Anyway, yeah, say for your car. I thought these were super cute. So I got, I got two of each. I got, uh, yeah, I got two, one more of each of these in my bag, in my Dollar Tree bag, as you guys can see. So yeah, I had to get one. I wasn't about to walk out of there with just one ear. I had to get all of them. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, these are so cute. I'm so proud of these, y'all. My 70s. I'm a 70s child. I got 80s babies. I got some 90s babies and I got my little my last babies in the 2000s like I'm done that's it no more we're done we are done and I'm done for my 99 cent store haul and my small Dollar Tree haul I am done 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 I hope you guys like this haul I hope you guys enjoyed this haul I did it was fun for me because I, I love everything I got and it's not even a huge haul and I love it like sometimes you can be small but mighty you know what I'm saying so uh, I want to thank everyone for tuning in. Please um, um, give this video a thumbs up if you like Dollar Tree and 99 cent store hauls and you like the items that I have. Let me know, leave me a comment. Let me know what you guys got, what you found, what you're looking for, what you're on the hunt for. I have a couple other wish list items I'm looking for, but I'm trying to scale back as best as I can and try to practice, you know, some kind of self control if I can. But yeah. And, um, you know, I want to thank all my wonderful subscribers, like, some that, like, always, always comment, like, um, okay, I was pronouncing her name wrong. I think she said I pronounced it Delilah, Delilah Camacho, um, and she's 99 cents store and more on Instagram. 
and then uh, Lupita, 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 um, Lupita, is it? I almost said Camacho, oh lord, anyway, on here, she's California, I don't know how to pronounce it, but anyway, she always, always comments on my videos, leave me nice comments, and someone just commented, I haven't responded to comments yet, Madonna Street, girl, I said, girl, you, I ain't forgot about you, you say you in Stockton, so you're not even that far from me, we're going to have to hook up and link up one day, uh, what's her name, Fat, uh, is it Fabiola Kazima, Kazima, something like that? She keeps saying, "I'm in, I'm girl, I'm in California too. I'm up here by the state capitol. I'm not in the Bay Area no more." She's just said, "I'm girl, I'm in California." And who else? There's so many wonderful people. Oh, the um, beautiful um, Native family. Um, there's just so many people. It's a deal. Um, let me see on here. Lauren Wesley. She's Lily Black. Something on um, Instagram. Instagram and I just found out that Vivian Rodriguez I have forgot she changed her Instagram name it's now she's queen of the 99 so check her out sway to the 99 check him out 99 be popping 99 um 99 cent and more 99 and more 99 cent and store and more I think it is 99 cent store and more all y'all all y'all are important I love all you guys and I thank you and I, trust me I appreciate you guys and I'm going to have that appreciation giveaway coming up really really soon and let me end this so I can uh, get into the kitchen and record this cooking video for y'all you know what I'm saying and then uh yeah make sure y'all tune in for that if you guys like to eat you guys eat right you guys like cooking you know so tune in for that and uh, if you have kids that are going back to school you know check out my back to school uh, clothing haul and I got some more stuff coming up for you guys to check out and hopefully I, mean, I love you guys I appreciate everybody if I forgot anybody I love you all and don't forget to like I said to give me a big thumbs up big a big thumbs up I appreciate you guys support I need you guys support I wouldn't be where I'm at without you guys supporting come on let's get this video out there and share it and comment and you know and all that kind of good stuff and you know subscribe it's free stick around you know what I'm saying I got a little something for everybody just put it like that subscribe it's free let's get up there let's move let's grow this channel subscribe 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 it's free it's free give me a thumbs up it's free too it ain't hurting you I everybody I watch I give a thumbs up support me and I support you back you know what I'm saying let's support each other and I will see you guys in the next one